Hello, you're welcome to solve this math problem, which is a square minus b is equal to 133. b square minus a is equal to 133. To find the values of a comma b such that a is not equal to b. Now, let's start by letting this as equation 1 and this as equation 2. Then, in the first step, we'll take equation 1 minus equation 2 whereas equation 1 in the left side it is a square minus b then minus equation 2 in the left side we we'll place inside the bracket so it is this b square minus a bracket is equal to in the right side it will be 133 minus 133 which is 0 then it will be a square minus b open the bracket by negative so it will be minus b square here it will be plus a is equal to zero then here will, it will be a square minus b square so here a square minus b square then plus a minus b so here plus a minus b is equal to zero then from here a square minus b square is same as a plus b bracket times bracket a minus b bracket then plus this here we place inside the bracket so bracket a minus b bracket is equal to zero then from here a minus b is common so we'll take a minus b bracket outside the bracket so this here divided by a minus b it is this a plus b then here a minus b divided by a minus b it is 1 so it will be plus 1 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas this first solution of a minus b is equal to 0 and we have the other solution of a plus b plus 1 is equal to 0 then from this solution a minus b is equal to 0 we take negative b to this side so it will be a is equal to b but note that the condition from our problem a is not equal to b so here a is not equal to b so this solution is rejected then from this solution here it will be a plus b is equal to negative one so this solution here we we'll call this equation three then in the next step we we'll take here in the first step we we'll take equation one minus equation two so in the next step we'll take equation we we'll take equation one plus equation two Whereas equation 1 in the left side it is a square minus b plus b square minus a. So here a square minus b plus b square minus a is equal to equation, equation 1 plus equation 2 in the right side. It will be 133 plus 133. So here it will be this plus this. So a square plus b square, then minus a minus b minus a minus b is equal to 133 plus 133, it is 266. Then into here it will be a square plus b square is equal to this 266. We take here minus a minus b to this side, so it will be plus a plus b. Then here it will be a square plus b square is equal to 266. But not here. a plus b is from equation 3. a plus b is negative 1. So here it will be plus a plus b it is negative 1. We substitute here. Then in the next step, it will be a square plus b square is equal to 
266 plus negative 1, it is 265. So, not this equation. Here, this equation, let's call this, because this is equation 3, so this will call this equation 4. Then, in the next step, here, because we have a square plus b square, then we apply the rule, so from the rule, which is a plus b bracket square. The expansion of this is equal to a square plus b square plus 2ab. So here it will be a plus b bracket square is equal to a square plus b square. a square plus b square it is this 265 plus 2ab. Then from here a plus b, here a plus b is from equation 3. a plus b is negative 1. So here it will be negative 1 bracket square is equal to 265 plus 2ab then here negative 1 square it is 1 is equal to 265 plus 2ab so into here it will be this will take to this side so it will be 1 minus 265 is equal to 2ab so 1 minus 265, it is negative 264, is equal to 2ab. Then from here, we divide by 2 in both sides. So this and this will cancel. So it will be ab is equal to negative 264 divided by 2, it is negative 132. Then not this answer here for the value of a b then in the next step in the first step we take a plus b bracket square then in the next step from a minus b bracket square the expansion of this is equal to a square plus b square minus 2 a b so from here it will be a minus b bracket square is equal to a square plus b square. It is this here, 200, 265 minus 2 ab. ab, it is this, minus 132 bracket. So here it will be a minus b bracket square is equal to 265 minus 2 times minus 132 it is plus it is plus this time this is here 2 then 6 4 so here it will be a minus b bracket square is equal to this plus this here this plus this it is 9 this plus this it is 12 goes 1 this plus this is 2 plus 1 it is this plus this is 4 plus 1 it is 5 then here to get a minus b we'll apply square root in both sides so it will be a minus b bracket square here we apply square root is equal to also here we apply square root it will be square root of 200 529 then from here this square root you can say square so it will be a minus b is equal to it will be plus or minus Square root of 529. 529 square root here. It is by 2. 2 times 2, it is 4. Then here we left 1. The square of this, it is 4. Then here, 3. 3, here 3. So 3 times 3, we drop this 2, 9. So 3 times 3 is 9. 3 times 4, it is 12. So here, square root of 529 it is 23 so from here we have two solutions of a minus b whereas we have a minus b is equal to when it is positive it is 23 and we have a minus b is equal to when it is negative it is minus 23 
then from here we have a minus b a minus b then we'll compare with the other solution of a plus b whereas a plus b it is this negative one so from a plus b is equal to negative one here a plus b is equal to negative one then in the next step to solve from this first solution here let's add these two equations so it will be a plus a it is 2a negative b plus b it is 0 is equal to 23 plus negative 1 it is 22 then from here we divide by 2 in both sides so this and this will cancel it will be a is equal to 22 divided by 2 it is 11 then the next step we recall this equation of a plus b is equal to negative 1 whereas a a it is 11 so it will be 11 plus b is equal to negative 1 so here it will be b is equal to negative 1 11 take this side to be minus 11 so into here it will be b is equal to negative 1 plus 11 is negative 12 so here we have a comma b is equal to a it is 11 b is negative 12 so here it will be 11 comma negative 12 so here we got the first solution then to solve from the second solution whereas from this solution here second solution here we add these two equations by elimination method so it will be a plus a it is 2a then here negative b plus b is 0 is equal to negative 23 plus negative 1 it is equal to negative 24 then from here we divide by 2 in both sides so this and this will cancel it will be a is equal to negative 24 divided by 2 it is negative 12 then we recall the third equation which is this here a plus b is equal to negative 1 so from a plus b is equal to negative 1 here it will be a is negative 12 plus b is equal to negative 1 so here it will be b is equal to negative 1 negative 12 take this side to be plus 12 so it will be b is equal to 12 minus 1 it is 11 so here it will be a comma b is equal to a it is negative 12 comma b is 11 so this is our second solution now from here let's check our solutions so to check whereas from our equations it was a square minus b is equal to 133 and b square minus a is equal to 133 now to check from this solution here we'll check for by using this first equation so from a square minus b is equal to 133 so here a square it will be 11 square so here 11 square minus b b is minus 12 so here minus 12 bracket is equal to 133 so 11 square it is 121 minus minus it will be plus plus 12 is it equal to 133 so here this plus this is 133 is equal to 133 so left side and right side are equal then it is true for this first solution here or we can check by using this second equation which is b square minus a second equation is equal to 133 3 so b square b square it is negative 12 so it will be negative 12 bracket square minus a 
a it is 11 minus 11 is it equal to 133 so negative 12 squared will be positive 144 minus 11 is it equal to 133 so this minus this it is here to be 1 3 3 is equal to 133 so left side and right side are equal then it is proven for the first equation second equation this source first solution is correct now in the next step let's check for this second solution here so for second solution whereas a is equal to this negative 12 and b is equal to 11 so here by using this first equation here of a square minus b is equal to 133 so here it will be a it is negative 12 bracket square minus b it is 11 is equal to 133 so negative 12 square is positive 144 minus 11 is it equal to 133 so this minus this is 133 is equal to 133 so left side and right side are equal then it is proven for the first equation now let's check the second equation of b square minus a is equal to 133 so b square it will be 11 square so here 11 square minus a it is this negative 12 is it equal to 133 so 11 square it is 121 negative and negative to be positive 12 is it equal to 133 so 121 plus 12 it is 133 is equal to 133 so left side and right side are equal then it is proven for the first equation second equation the second solution is correct so we have two solutions which are correct thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye